little sprinkler is rotting at my door frame here and I've started to cut it and all these little termite pellets come out so I think I'm gonna go a little higher. Chip this away. Oh yeah. Lots of termite poops in there. Ew! And pincher bugs. pieces. Oh, it's getting a little firmer there, but definitely need to go up a little higher. Okay, I use my oscillating tool to cut through here and down here. And I'm just gonna try to break this out. Oh, maybe a little deeper. Nothing's ever easy. I'm gonna take it up to there. Okay, so I cut out this segment of my wood frame around my door. This was termite damagey and with this tool and pried it out with a screwdriver and such. And then this is what's left in here. It's pretty firm. First, I'm gonna put some wood hardener on there with a bristle brush. the wood. Get it in there real good a few times. I just went over it five or six times and I really tried to get in the grooves where there's any holes. This is one of my most favorite products of all time. It's awesome and it works really good to take care of wood rot and um, fill in those gaps. It's like the softest um, Play-Doh. I can't remember what the soft one's called, but that's what it's like. It's two part. You have to mix them together and hopefully I have enough left of this to do the job. This is pretty pricey, but worth every penny. Okay, so here it is inside and it's a little firmer than usual. You put equal parts looks about right so I'm gonna mix that together until the color is all one single color okay so it's all one solid color and the thing I love about this is that it squishes up inside as deep as you need it to you just keep stuffing and stuffing and then it dries really hard but still sandable so I'm gonna go ahead and work that into there and that groove Just did kind of a messy job because I'm going to put the piece of wood in there, um, but you can really take your time and mold this how you want it pretty well. Here's a piece of wood. I'm just going to tap it in with the, my other hand, and I'm going to put a little piece of wood in between there so I don't dent that. Okay, and there's what it looks like after I've got the piece of wood in there. It's pretty flush. I can sand it later, but I wanted to fill this a little more. So I wanted the wood in there first before I finished filling it. Okay, so this is a little challenging to do with the phone in my hand, but what I really want to do is fill this part first, I think, at the bottom. Especially since I may run into more water issues, my sprinkler kind of tends to aim this way. I did a pretty terrible job with the wood cutting, but there are reasons for it. I'm just not gonna go into it. Partly maybe lazy, <laughs> but I told myself I wasn't gonna let this project take over my whole everything, so. I'm gonna need a little more and I want to try and kind of build it out a little bit maybe to match the wood 
there. Okay, in the end, this is what it looks like. I found it was useful to use this paint um, stick to smooth things out. It's a little, it's kind of drying now, so it's time to leave it alone, but um, that's how I got my smoothest edge. Right there, which I think looks pretty good. Then I went back to try and fix it, messed it up a little bit, so I'm gonna really leave it alone now. Um, and I'll sand it out later and got my repair. Looking pretty good. The working life of this product is 30 to 60 minutes, which is great. It gives you some time to do what you need to do. Okay, here's how it turned out, and looks pretty good. Nothing a little caulk and sanding can't make look great. I can hardly believe I'm saying this because I hate this green color, but I'm gonna go ahead and touch this up just to show you what it looks like because I'm not painting the whole door yet. So I'm just gonna touch it up real quick. minute paint job. The paint is still wet and obviously not very good. There's my worst part right there. The transition. I should have sanded it a little better but I'm in a hurry and this is just to make it look nicer. If my first timer attempt helped you please like and subscribe. Have a blessed day.